Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. I am back on a little club dig. Uh, we're on a little space we ain't been before, Jim. I'm out with my pal Jimbo. You know he is, funnel on the finds. Go and check him out, he puts out some good little vids. And we're hoping to have a little bit, Jim, aren't we? We will have a little bit. We will we'll have a little bit, bit won't we? Because we're going to put the mileage in yep. and we're going to find something. Yep. And there's a lost gold chain. And we're going to find it. <laughs> so guess what, guys? We will see you on the first. See you in a bit. Well, we're on with Jimbo, guys. We've got a banging little 8990. Uh, and we both sort of just said, you know what, it's quite tight. It could be shrapnel, but if it ain't shrapnel, we're thinking it could be a little bit of coinage. We're open. And he's still in. Uh, to be fair, though, Jim, we want it a little bit deeper because we don't want a spendable, do we? No, we don't. I'm going to come down a little bit because Jimbo is on it. There it is. Yeah, yeah. Ah, that's why it sounded good, mate. Ah, there you go, guys. Right sort of size, right sort of shape, wrong reward. And we will see you on the next one. We are back on the little 77. I've just pulled it out of there quite deep, to be fair. Thought we'd find it together. But it's here somewhere. Oh, what have we got? Uh, it's like a button. Or a mount. Not sure on that one, guys. We will take it. It goes in the pot. And I will see you on the next one. Oh, well, guys, I am on a lunch break. Uh, the Evans have opened. I'm back in the motor. Uh, it's absolutely peeing down, uh, and I'm going to have a bit of grub. I ain't had nothing major, to be fair. I've had a couple of little bits, little buckle, a couple of other bits of crap. Uh, hopefully the rain will ease off a bit, but if it don't, I shall don the waterproofs, and we'll get back out there. But, yeah, it ain't been too bad so far. It's quite easy digging. It's quite flat, so we'll see how we get on. You know how it goes, guys. I'll have this bit of grub, I'll have a coffee, and I'll get back out there, and I will see you in a bit well 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 guys we are back on and we're with me old pal dave you know who he is here he is little smile on his face can only mean one thing is it big silver you jammy git davy well done fella uh we've had a little look at it i'm just gonna do a zoom while you're holding it dave yep. look at that guys that is a little henry the seventh it's a 1485 to 1509 and it's a little half groat, Dave. No, it's oh, it's a full groat. And I'll tell you what it is, Dave. It's a peach, mate. It's Can we? It is lovely. Can we spin that round, mate? Yeah, London Mint. London Mint. And I'll tell you what, it's what we call big silver. Don't worry about that. And it goes in Dave's pot. And he that is over mean. the moon. <laughs> That'll do him. Well done, Dave. Good find, fella. Cheers, mate. And we will see you on your next bit, mate, won't we? Hopefully, yeah. We will do. See you soon. All right, guys, I'm back on and I've got Cliff. And Cliff has also had a little Emery this seventh. So we actually know, like I just said on the previous, it's a 1485 to 1509. Uh, they clean up, though, Cliff, would not it? Yeah, that clean up. It's still nice, though, mate, isn't it? And it's big silver. Yeah, hammered. Eh? Yep. That big silver, guys, and that is the second one of them today. So Cliff will take it, but he's also got another bit of big silver. Uh, and that is what we call a gothic flooring, Cliff, isn't it? Don't think it's gothic. Oh, don't you? Is it just no, a flooring? The writing, the writing is English, just a flooring. Um, and we know it's a young Ed Vicky, don't we? So yeah. we know she's 1837 to... 1901, don't we? Give or take, yeah. Yeah, we've got a date on there anywhere? No. Or... Well, I'll tell you what, though, Cliff, it's still big silver, mate. Absolutely. And it'll go in your pot. Well found, fella. Thank you. Uh, crack on to the next. That rain's stopped now. We'll get so... back out there, see what else you can find, Cliff, will we? On my way now. Cush thee. Cheers, mate, for showing me, and I no will see you in a bit. Oh, we are back on, guys. Uh, didn't film the dig. Out of there, up to there. We finally got ourselves a little coin. Uh, not 100% what it is because I ain't looked at it. I just sort of got it out and thought, oh, I better bung the camera on. Uh, looks like it could be apney. But I'll tell you what, it's been all day coming. But one good thing, I don't think it's a modern spendable, which everyone else seems to be getting. But yeah, we'll take that. See if we can get a date off it. It'd be nice, wouldn't it? 
Uh, looking like a George. Yep, yeah, I think little 1917 George fifth half penny. And we will take it and it goes in the pot. And I will see you on the next one. We are back on, guys. Uh, it was down in there. Uh, here it is. This is toasted as you like. But it is another coin. I will take them. Don't get me wrong. Like I say, toasted. But probably another little George. Uh, not sure if we're going to get anything off of it. But it's definitely a coin. I don't know. Well, let's do a little zoom, see if we can see anything on here. There we go. What have we got? Not sure. But either way, it's another coin, and it's in the pot. And I will see you on the next one. Right, well that guy's there was the hole I've just got that coin out of. The and then I'm literally here, and I've got a little 95. Don't get me wrong, could be 50 cal. But I'll tell you what, I'm certainly not leaving it in there. Little 95, let's see what we got. Come on, be a little bit of silver. Cause if it's a 50 cal, well, like I say, you can't leave them. Right, we are still in. Uh, right, we've got a little bit off the point already. Yeah, we've got a little bit off the point there. Hello, baby. Uh, oh, we've got another coin. Let it be silver. Come on. We have got ourselves a little silver. Come on. And we will take it. I definitely will. That, I don't even need to look. I can see that's a silver. That's a George. So we'll give it a clean up, guys. That could be a little florin. That is a little florin, I think, guys. Let's go a little bit softer on this one. Uh, looks, like a, looks like a George V to me. And it looks like a florian. Alright, can we get a date off it? Um, we've got the date there, 1919. So, Little George V, 1919, full silver, florian. And I will take it. And I will see you on the next one. We're back on with another little 85, guys. Don't get me wrong, here it is. It's another coin, and guess what? It's only next to them other holes that I've just had. But there it is. So basically, I've had three coins up here. One silver, and a couple of other... That's definitely a little George. Yeah, there he is. Pretty sure it's a little George. Yep, we'll go with a little George fifth again on that. Uh, and I'm going to say half penny again. That's the Britannia on this side. But we will take it. There he is. That is definitely a George. See him in there? And I will see you on the next one. All right, there we go, guys. That was the first one. Got a George out. That there was the George um, Florian Silver 1919. Right, next to it, the one I've just dug out of there, is another little George. So I've had three coins. One, two, three. In that patch. We are back on, guys. I am in the same vicinity. I've had a little 92. And here we are. Can you hear something on there? And it is a coin. Come on, we will take it. Another bit of silver. Get in there. Come on. I am on a little roll. That's a little Vicky, isn't it? No. Oh, could it be? That is a little Vicky, isn't it? I'll tell you what, that is a little silver, and I will take it. Don't worry about that. Yeah. Think. Think, Vicky. 
Yeah. <sighs> a little bit toasted this side, but that'll come off. Don't tell me, that is... Ooh. That looks quite nice, Rich. That looks lovely. That looks quite nice, mate, doesn't it? I've got my pal Rich next to me. We was just talking about I'm on a little coin spill. And I've gone, hang about, I've only got another one here. Um, but I'll take it, that's two silvers. Out of two holes. Oh, we might be able to get a little bit off this one, guys. It's a shame, but I'm pretty sure she's a little Vicky. She's silver. She is silver, and I am on a roll. Kit, it is. And I will see you in on the next. Come on. Here we go, guys. There's your bit of nature for the day. A load of toadstools. And I will see you in a bit. Oh, we are back on, guys. We're with me old pal Jimbo. He's just given me a little shout. He went, Paul, I'm going home. He's got a bit of a journey ahead of him and he's got to go to work tomorrow, so he don't want to leave it too late. I said, Jimbo, what you got, mate? How you got on? And he went, do you know what? I've had a few little bits, Paul. Yeah. Go on then, mate. I had a modern penny to start with. All right, hang on. Let me come around there, Jim, so I can see. That's modern it. penny? Yeah. Thinking that's a modernish. You know, not a new new 5p, but the, what, like uh, a sort of shilling, shilling or something? Five, yeah, yeah. Thinking that old penny, yeah, another old penny, yeah, toasted, don't know, right? And then I got five farthings. See, that's nice, all in one hole. So, you've had a coin spill with, coin. with five farthings, and we know they're all George and they're all the little wren farthing, Jim, aren't they? Well, I know two of them are 1949 and one of them 1940, but I don't know what the other two yet to right. clean them up. Right, but we think they're all Georges, so they're all going to be yeah, roughly the same, the same sort of area. But what a lovely little find, Jim, to have five in one hole. It was. Hey, look at that. That has made your pot look nice, yeah, mate, has not it? You've got to be happy with that, Jim. Yeah, then just Well, let me have a little and... zoom on your, on your coins, mate. There we go. There we go, guys. So we've got the five farthings there. Uh, we've got a little button. Is there a little button, Jim? Yeah, yeah we so. think a little button. Uh, we've got the couple of pennies. We've got perhaps a little modern, little modern penny. But I'll tell you what, Jimbo, it's a pot full of coins, mate. It is. And it's from really a couple of hours ago... That's right. You've done well, Jim. Yeah. So you're happy with that, mate, aren't you? Yeah, have you had a good day? I always have a good day. Yeah, you've enjoyed it? As always. And we... We'll see you on the next one, we mate, will. won't we? We will. Thanks for showing me, Jimbo. You're welcome. And I will see you soon, mate. See you soon. Oi, oi, guys, I've got me pal Phil on. Uh, he ain't been on the channel for a while, mate, have you? I haven't, no. Um, I haven't had anything to show you. No, yeah. but he has today. Yeah. He's pulled himself. What is it, mate? It's a James II, 1688. Oh. I believe it's a shilling, because it's 25 millimetres across, which is right. a shilling. Right, so. OK, mate, I'm going to do a little zoom. You got it? Can I have a little look? Yeah, oh, yeah cheers, Phil. Yeah, the dates on the obviously. Oh, the look at the yeah. condition of this. Little James first. Uh, James, James second, second yeah. sorry. Little yeah. James second. Uh, what a it's beautiful condition, it is, mate. It's lovely. Yeah. It, it was don't, deep, like yeah. everything else on this field. What? Was what? Deep, ten? Uh, eight to ten? Eight, uh, seven to eight. Was yeah. it? So, yeah. It's still yeah. deep though, mate, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. But I'll tell you what, Phil. What a cracker, mate. Yeah, lovely. Yeah. What a little peach, mate, and you'll Thank take you. that all day long. And you had Too a couple right. of other little bits in there, mate, yeah. didn't you? Well, a bunch of the old typical. Right, seals. don't get me wrong. Yeah. His, his bit of silver is his find of the day. And then a few little decorative. But we got this. There. We're thinking sort of scallopy, shelly sort of design. Uh, not sure if it's a bit of furniture or. But we like it, don't we, Phil? Yeah, and it's not broken. It no, like it's, it's much intact. intact. Yeah. Um, little mounting point on there, so that probably had a little spike yep. that went in. Pressed it onto something. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but no, that's still nice, mate. Uh, a little horse mount, which we see quite a lot of these filled, don't we? Yeah, we do. Sometimes yeah. they're in better nick, but yeah. it's still a little fine, mate, and you've got the two bits on. Yep. So, yeah, you'll take that, mate. Um, all in all, then, Phil, not too bad, mate. Happy oh, with that, well, wouldn't you? Yeah. You love a bit of we silver. Do. It's when it's only milled as well. Yeah, we'll take that. Well, Phil will. Cheers. And cheers for showing me, Phil. And I will see you on your next bit, yeah, mate. Absolutely.
All right, guys, we are back on. I've got my old pal Rich. Remember, Rich, he was on the last vid with his little hammered. Uh, he's back on today with another little bit of silver, mate. What's going on? What do you got, mate? French coin. Oh. It's silver. Oh, a little French silver. 1918, we said, didn't we? 1918. Right, hang on. One Let me franc. do a little zoom. Oh, there it is. So it's a little silver franc. There you go, guys. Look at that. And I'll tell you what, Rich, that's immaculate, mate. It is in good condition. Yep. And guess what, mate? You will take it. And I don't blame you. Because, again, we like we like different bits, mate, don't we? I didn't expect a French, do I? No. And I'll tell you what, though, mate, it's a nice little coin. Well done. I'll well found. Yeah, take yeah, I don't blame you, mate. And I, now, mate, will see you... Next time you're out having a dig. Definitely. See you soon, fella. Yeah, see you soon. Hi, guys. It is that time of the night, and I am back at the motor. Uh, it's been a long old day. It's about six o'clock. I've got the gaffer over there still, and I've got Richard over there still. We are the last three on the field. Um, oh, no, we ain't. We've got Mark somewhere about as well. There's his truck over there. He must be still out there, then. Uh, generally, it's me last, but not today. Uh, I'm going to do a little roundup, guys. It ain't finds of the century, but what it is, is finds that have saved me. Because up to a couple of hours ago, I didn't have a lot. So I'll give you a little look, and uh, I will see you in a bit. Right, here we go, guys. We're in on the roundup. Uh, a few bits of cat, little 50 cow. Obviously, I've got quite a bit of rubbish as well in my bag. A uh, little iron buckle. Uh, sounded all right, though. Very deep. A uh, little mount of some type, we're thinking. Um, yeah, it was a bit longer than that on the back, but it snapped off. But yeah, a little mount, so we'll take that. Uh, cut them out a little bits of cake. I think that's a modern bit of cake. But what I did end up doing, I went on a little field, pulled out a, pulled out a little George to start. Then right next to it was another little... Uh, no, I didn't, sorry. I pulled a George out in the corner, walked halfway across the field, pulled out another little George... Then next to that was a little bit of silver, which we'll take. It's a little George um, Florin. There it is. A uh, little 1919, little George V. Uh, so that's silver. So I'll take that all day long. Uh, then I had another little George right next to it. You've seen on the video the four holes that I showed you. Uh, basically, they was three... Uh, two Georges, sorry. So it was two Georges, two silvers all next to each other. And my nice little bit of silver as well. We've got a little Vicky veil head. Um, and again, silver. So I will take it. But them coins save the day. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care. And I will see you next time I'm out having a dig. See you soon. You know that I'm a keep it cool With you I feel like breaking rules On the edge looking out